in high definition. This is the CBS 13 News at 5. Ten people were arrested today during a budget protest. This was outside Governor Brown's office. This group is backing in-home supportive services for people who need care. The governor wants to cut $225 million from the program, which provides care to the sick and disabled in their homes. That's his way, the governor's way, to help close the budget deficit. Protesters, though, wanted to make their voices heard. But when some refused to move away from the entrance to the governor's office, they were arrested. I'm willing to do whatever it takes. If, if being arrested comes with the territory, then I just got to go. I mean, you know... We got to get this point across. The people need to know. Meanwhile, budget negotiations continue today. Lawmakers are facing a Friday deadline to pass a balanced state budget. The Senate and Assembly met today to take up proposals from legislative Democrats. The governor's plan calls for more than $2 billion in welfare cuts, but Democrats want to restore that money and cut the reserve fund instead. In just hours, the Sacramento City Council will vote on a budget that includes job cuts. If the current budget passes, it will eliminate 252 full-time positions, and 168 of those are fire and police jobs. The city is urging employee unions to make concessions to try and save some of those jobs.